Hi, it's Dr. Anka Martalog, naturopathic doctor from dranka.com, practicing in Richmond Hill, Ontario, Canada. I know all this homeopathy, how to take it and the rules about it, it all sounds a little bit confusing because homeopathics are energetic remedies. The way I explain it is that they give your body a kick in the right direction and then the body will follow through and will do what ne what's necessary. So basically homeopathics stimulate your vital force. So in order to get the full benefit of homeopathics, you have to follow certain rules. So basically you have to take them about half an hour, 20-30 minutes away, meaning before, after food, coffee and mint. Mint, toothpaste, breath freshener, tic tac, gum, etc. My method I have been using for 15 years, I basically discovered that when I was bombarded with cancer patients at the beginning of my career. And I was wondering how am I going to get these people to get so many homeopathics? Because sometimes, in order to get the full benefit of homeopathy, you have to use combinations of homeopathics. So I came up with this method 15 years ago and it's still working. What you have to do basically, you have to take a bottle of water and put all the drops in the water and combine all the remedies that I'm going to give you and just count the drops, 30, 40, 50, 45, 50 drops, whatever, per day. Turn back. And then we will call this your and then we will call this your homeopathic remedy water. And then the next day you will take a third of the bottle about three times a day, of course, away from away from meals, like I mentioned before, away from food, coffee, and mint. This usually works by taking it around your meal time, as in 30 minutes before, 30 minutes after. Or some people like taking it mid-morning, mid-afternoon and mid-evening. For children, for example, because they go to school, the best way to take it is take a third of the bottle before they go to, sk to school, first thing when they come back from school in the afternoon and then another time between dinner and bedtime. So by the end of the day, this homeopathic water is, is done. And then in the evening again, when you have that free one minute, you prepare it for the next day. For children also, I find that it is good. It is good to use a marker and empower them and just to mark where the one third would be so they know how much to drink at a time. Of course, you might not get all the one third amount in one, one, uh, one mouthful, but it's okay to take a few mouthful of the third. The third. Another thing you have to remember is when you take the water, swish it around a little bit so it gets under the tongue because that's where the homeopathies get absorbed. Don't worry if you feel overwhelmed. It's normal. It's just like anything new and everybody feels like that. And remember, I did not invent these rules. They've been alive since homeopathy. And now I'd like to... Um, to invite you to register for my free Q&A telesessions where you can ask me more questions like this the, about homeopathics and generally about naturopathy and you can provide the Q's and I provide the A's as much as I can as to the best I, the best I can. See you there.